Scunthorpe Scorpions can seal victory with a race to spare here in heat number 14 if they can take a 5-1 over the Berwick Bandits. Jordan Palin is in blue off the inside, replacing the uh, struggling Josh McDonald in a reserve switch. Gate 2 for Berwick in white is Danny Gapmeyer. Gate 3 in red, it's Tero Arneo. And Gate 4 in yellow, Leon Flint. Another great performance today from both of the number 7s. Jordan Palin with 6 points, including a race win. Leon Flint is on 9. Palin replacing the scoreless Josh McDonald. Tero Arneo, another consistent performance. He's on at seven points, just the one defeat for him today. Third place in Heat 3. Completing the lineup is Danny Gapmeyer. He's had a great day on ten points and will be the main threat here. So four high-scoring riders so far in this meeting. Four heats at number 14, 40-38 the score. And Scunthorpe seal it with a 5-1. Palin, Gapmeyer, Arneo, and Flint is the lineup, tapes up and away they go. A good start by the Scorpions pairing. Jordan Paling gets away well, trying to get around the outside is Tano Arneo. He blocks Leon Flint on the first turn. Danny Gapmeyer's there on the inside. They're side by side for second place. It's Palin with the lead. Jordan Palin very much a rising star out in front. Tano Arneo, the Finn, trying to get around the outside of Danny Gapmeyer. Finland v Austria, a battle you don't see very often in speedway. Round the outside comes Arneo now into turn three. Has he done enough to take second place? They're still side by side as they complete the second lap. Arneo sticking to that wider line. Something of a specialist on that wide line here at the Eddie Wright Raceway. And he takes second now from Danny Gapmeyer. If it stays like this, Scunthorpe will keep up their unbeaten home record in the league with a race to spare. It's Jordan Palin out front. And Leon Flint, surprisingly, not able to get among the scorers in this one. It looks as though Scunthorpe are going to hang on to seal the win with a race to go. Here they come towards the chequered flag. Jordan Palin and Tano Arneo finish together. Danny Gapmeyer third. Leon Flint at the back. Jordan Palin is overjoyed with that one. That's a 5-1 to the Scorpions. That sows the matchup with one race to go. And in league competition this year, Scunthorpe are still unbeaten at home. Brilliant from Jordan Palin and from Tano Arneo today. Dro dropping just one point to an opponent. Danny Gapmeyer held second initially, but Arneo persisted on that outside line. It was Palin all the way from the start. Tello Arneo round the outside into turn three on his favoured line. Leon Flint stuck at the back in that one in yellow. And Scunthorpe take the 5-1 that they needed to seal victory. Great battle there for second place. It was a win for Jordan Palin. He's now on nine points. Second for Tello Arneo. He's on nine plus one. Third for Danny Gapmeyer. He moves on to 11, while Leon Flint stays on 9. And the win is sealed for Scunthorpe. It's Scunthorpe Scorpions 45, Berwick Bandits 39.